describe my perfect kind of guy. Yeah, perfect kind of guy. Mm -hmm. Man. <laughs> <laughs> what did you think about me going to study in Japan? <laughs> yes, what do you think about me doing YouTube? Uh, initially. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Chilo here once again, as always. If you're new to my channel, my name is Chioma, aka Chilo. In Nigerian, currently living and studying in Japan. Although currently I came to Nigeria to visit. That video should have been up by now. I'll link it somewhere up in somewhere of you watch the video. I came to Nigeria after three years, guys. Like it's been mind blowing. The love has been overwhelming. I've been soaking in the moment. But today is the most anticipated video of my life in my YouTube career. I did not believe that a day like this would come this fast. Like I'll have my mom do mother tag with me. <laughs> so guys, from the title of this video, you know. I'm doing a mother tag with my amazing mother, my one and only mother, my super mom, my love, the love of my life. Yes, so. <laughs> so guys, I have my mother with me and we're going to be doing mother tag. So this is how mother tag works. I'm going to be throwing some questions at my mom to know how well she knows me from childhood, from even now, just how well she knows me, literally. Let's know if Mama Chilo knows Chilo well. So mommy, do you think you know me well? Yes. You know me very well. I know you very well. So if you fail any question, what should what should my subscribers do? Oh, you flog me. You give me 24 steps. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So guys, I have some questions here already that I wrote down and then I snapped it on this phone. I'll be asking her. Me, I want to know the answers too. See, I want to know if this woman knows me very well because we used to gist a lot. So, are you ready? Yes. You're very ready? I'm very ready. Okay. Mm. The first question, guys, is what was i like as a child as a child you uh -huh. Shilo, you were very tiny tiny child and you refused to eat ah uh, so you were looking as if uh, so like a child that was malnourished uh -uh. yes you refused to eat but yeah. let's be honest I'm, you're not on the big side now and they say like mother like <laughs> like daughter uh -uh. where would i get the fat from uh, is your father not fat? <laughs> <laughs> so that's the only thing that you have yeah. to say about me as a child. Yes, so uh, and then great, great noise maker. I was a noise maker. Yes, noise maker. Me. Yes. I don't believe this one. <laughs> me like this quiet me. Ah yeah yeah. You it's your man <laughs> quiet. <laughs> Mommy, I was a noise maker. No, you only tell that to someone that doesn't know you. But for me. Ah, I know you too. You should not believe I'm very mm. quiet too. No, you are not too. Okay, what about now? Trouble maker, trouble pursuer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what about now? Now, nah. uh, you are still the same chairman. Now, have you changed? <laughs> let's, let's move to the second question because this one is now casting. <laughs> the second question is what I really want to know the answer about this question, uh, guys, because I'm interested. Yes. Sir. What do you think about me doing YouTube? Uh, initially. Uh, the day I saw that the first one you post, I was shocked and I saw you with a man. <laughs> so I was scared. I said, This one and uh, this one is post, uh, sending a picture of a man without that, uh, me knowing of it, what is going on. So I now started asking, I called you and I was asking you, Who is this person that you post this picture with? what was that's happening. exactly i have for guys <laughs> <laughs> i did not tell anybody oh, no. when i went to start youtube because i didn't know how they would receive it i did not know how they would take it i did not know if it is it was a new thing in my family my family is a very very simple laid back you know conservative family so i was like you know what the only way i'm going to know if they accept this thing is by posting the video and just watching their reaction it's very easy to know when they like something or someone so i posted it and i was just looking looking at them and if you if you've been a, if you've been a chilo talks member you know the very first video was the video i did um frequently asked questions about japan i did mm. it with stefan i'll yes. link that video up here it was actually with a guy mm -hmm. and then she was like this picture that you went and post with man <laughs> <laughs> because i shared it on all my social media handles and i was like mommy did you click it 
Did you click it? Yes, I didn't click it. The, the moment I saw the picture, I was scared. I said, what is happening to this girl? <laughs> like, this is not the person I know. Why post a picture with a man? So I was scared. Yeah, guys, I would I would hardly yeah. post a picture with a guy on social mm. media. That's just the truth. So, that, But now, how do you feel about YouTube? It's now I now realize what we are doing. Initially, I didn't understand it that way. So that was where the fear came in. Okay. So, but now I've now understood that it is not as I thought. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yes. Makes sense. Yes. Okay, guys, let's go to the third question. What is something funny I did when I was younger? Guys, please ignore the noise. <laughs> in the background, I have been, I've just been like, what's happening? Like, this is Nigeria. We live life to the fullest here. So there's a lot of noise going on outside the gates, but hopefully you can hear me with the mic. So the next question I said is, what is something funny I did when I was younger? Huh. I remember. Uh, I remember one day in ha. church. Narration. One day in church that they did children harvest. You were the one that read the news. And okay. at the end of the news, he said, this is Chioma Okeke speaking. The newscaster is Chioma Okeke. So everybody was just, ah, this girl, is she a newscaster? That <laughs> the way she said it, she said it very boldly. Yeah. So you are that kind of person that you are determined yeah. each time you want to do anything. So mm. it was very funny. You, you, just, you just sat down and you were just like, that's my child. That's my child that uh, I beat my chest that. In short, I trained <laughs> them, I tried my best okay. to bring them up or okay. give them all round upbringing. Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. The next question, guys, I'm mm. also interested in this one is what <laughs> did you think about me going to study in Japan? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that was the highest shock we had. Are you serious? Yes, it was a great shock. Came with great shock. Because we are scared. Mm. We, we are scared. We don't know how true the whole thing was. was yes. Yeah. So we are very scared. Personally, I was scared. Yeah, even my dad was. I remember mm. my dad told me something, guys. Mm. And I, I still tease him with it. He told me, if it is not true, come back. <laughs> 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 because, you know, the whole scholarship thing was yeah. like, why would they want to pay your school fees? Why would they want to do this? Uh, why would they want to do that? So he mm. was like, see, eh, mm. if it is not true come back so they were actually very scared what about now what do you think about studying in japan no now that we have known that what they are doing is reality yeah uh, we are no longer afraid scared. yes okay. and i've even spoken with your uh, professor pro professor okay mm. okay so how did you feel when you saw me for the first time after three years Ooh. Hmm. you people <laughs> that you did not kill me that day it is just God that you did not kill me that day is just God that I didn't know that anything of such was happening I didn't know that all along I was calling you you are in Nigeria so I didn't know that you just want to give me that shock of my life so I was I was shocked <laughs> yes, <laughs> guys, <laughs> that video should have been up by now. You guys already know I surprised everybody my sister, my mother, my BFF, uh. my friends, like my brother. I surprised uh. everybody. Uh. I don't know what happened. I just decided that you know what, we are going to do it this way. Uh. And you saw her screaming and jumping and shouting, Hey, oh, mama, oh, mama. <laughs> <laughs> uh. But how long did it, did, it, did it take you so long to? take it all in like this is reality is it this is this really chioma hmm. uh, because i saw you it was not phone call i saw you physically so it didn't take me time to realize it's a reality but you woke up at night and you said what hmm. is <laughs> did we sleep at all that night we stayed or uh, we were all awake gisting and talking 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 all through the night she's living out a pandemic confess she said she woke up at night and was just telling god hey god uh, so i want my life to see this girl uh, i'm alive to see this girl to see her after three years after three is it years. that long hmm. three years you did not see a child the only thing that was even helping me was the video call was the video and then call. youtube too yeah, yes. and then youtube too, at guys. least when i just and each time i call her and i don't get her she don't respond answer she's always panicking ah. i would say whom will i call 
Who will I call? Who will I call? Who will tell me about this girl? Who will I call? Okay, the next question is what is ah? Uh, this question. On cast me this YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> what is a weird habit of mine? Oh. Yeah, own you cannot even eat if the house is not clean. That one is the number one habit. Mm. If you don't finish what you are doing, you cannot eat. True. Mm -hmm. So that is number one habit. So I don't know. <laughs> just that. Let me just give you that Sleep one. Sleep, Uncle. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> this one can sleep in international level. She can sleep from morning to night without <laughs> even. And another thing about her is that. If you see, if she ever tell you she's in the house, she can be in the house for three months without, without even, going out. Without going out, <laughs> and it will not even bother her. It will not bother me, guys. Like, mm. I, I don't know where I, I, I learned that thing from. I can stay there. Just give me bed, mm. give me internet, give me fan, give mm. me food. Mm. I can stay there as three months. Three months without well, going out. But it's not anywhere. weird now. It's not weird. It's not a nice thing. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so the next question is if you had to rename me aside Chioma, what name will it be? I will rename you Favor. Favor. And I will rename you Gift from God. Gift from God, that's yes, English. God's gifts. What's Ibo do you have any Ibo name? Uh I will give you Amara. 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 I will name you Amara. Amara Chuku, Amara Chuku, Amara Chuku. Why? Uh, because the way things happen, the way you, you your life, you pattern your life, it's I always say it as it's just ordained by God. That's right. Mm. Okay. Mm. Okay. The next question, guys. Is, so, guys, nobody should call me Amara Shao. Uh, Don't call me Amara of Favor. My name is Choma. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, the next question is what food do I like the most? Mm. You like coconut rice. Coconut rice. The most. Coconut rice. Don't say this one. I will not even keep quiet. Coconut rice. You like coconut rice. You like coconut rice. And you like native foods. <laughs> <laughs> do you imagine that this girl cooks a uh, bitterly soup at Japan? In Japan. Uh, so you like native su food and you like coconut rice. Mm. Yes. Well, it's not bad now. Uh, I like food. That's the truth. Uh, I like food generally. See food, see sleep. Don't uh, use it and play with me. Uh, I can't go and beg you. <laughs> okay. So the next question is, what is one thing you wish I will do? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> This one is, is, is now more than jump jump question. You think you will do. One thing you wish mm. I will do. You will do. Well, I wish uh, before the end of your graduation, you get married. Nigerian mothers. <laughs> yes. Before the end of your graduation, you get married. Nigerian so mothers. I want to have my son-in-law beside me okay. yes guys can we move to the next question now already uh, yes so that's the one what is one thing you wish i yes. would yes before you get married you settle down as a young lady and god bless you with a man of your choice amen amen yes okay <laughs> <laughs> okay guys what is something i do that annoys you hmm. something you do that annoys me <laughs> <laughs> this is your laughter, eh? That is when you start packing my things and throwing them away. <laughs> that I like keeping loads. You ah. pack my things and you throw them away. You say you will say this one. You have two. Why the third one? You ah. have it. You have it. You have the third one. Why the fourth one? I will pack all of them and put it in the dustbin. This one you have not used it for the past two years. This one I will throw it away. That is Yoma for you. So she will pack everything in the house and throw it in the dustbin because she wants house that is empty, house that is free, house that is not filled up with bags and baggages. Guys, I will explain. I know oh. where this is coming from. Mm. I 
came back and I was like, why are you keeping load too much in this house? Uh, when there be space, like, okay. I don't, don't throw up, clean up and train up things inside this house. I'm like, let there be space. Mm. All this, see, Nigerian mothers are in the same WhatsApp group. People cannot tell me otherwise. All the aunties and uncles I know, I mean, uh, mothers I know, this is how they used to do. You will go for this thing, you will pack tray, pack tray, pack tray, keep inside store. Pack, pack, pack. Before you know, the whole place is choked up. Kaba. <laughs> how many tray will one person use? Okay, let me ask you a question. When you want to dry plenty things, is it one tray you use? It's not one tray, but Wait. at least, mommy, it's not one tray, but at least it's not 50 tray. <laughs> 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 eh, it's not okay. It's not one. No, I agree. It's not five. I agree. Uh, but it did not reach fifty. What are you trying? Are you trying <laughs> the whole world? Well, that is more than even for clothes. You. Hmm. Even our clothes. We will say we are not wearing again. Maybe it's no longer my size, or it's no longer something I want to wear. I want to throw or I want to that. What I will say, wait first. So before you throw it, if we should wait, let me go and be sure. If it's something that I will not dash, or if it's something that you will not use, she will not be forcing you. Mm. This particular top, is it not fine? You can use it. And I say, mommy, I don't want to wear again. Say, try now. Look at it. You can wear it. I'm just like, oh my God. I said I want to throw or dash. Don't, don't, don't. Why must you throw when we have so many people out there to dash it? That's my problem. So you don't supposed to throw it. But my problem. Uh, I, say, I, I, I always tell you, Pack them for me so that I will go through them thoroughly and I'll select the ones I will dash out and the ones I will throw. My, see, guys, this mm. is I like it. I like that she's she, my mom is a giver. Uh. But my problem is most times you she will say this thing and the thing you you, you now gather it now and say okay these are the things oh yeah sort it now let's go and give up. It will be in this house for five years <laughs> from now to 2028 that thing will be here and you're like you're still not giving this thing out. So she just like load. Af Nigerian mothers, please guys, tell me in the comment section. Nigerian mothers, they like load. That's the truth. Okay, the next question is, where will you like to see me in the next 10 years? In the next 10 years? Mm -hmm. What stage in life? What phase? What, what, what I would like I have to achieved? see you in your husband house with your children all living happily. Then I will be coming and I will be visiting you people. So that's how I would like it. I, mean, I will not like after 10 years, you will still be answering, Mommy, thank, telling me, Mommy, thank ma. So I want in the next 10 years, I will be visiting you, you will be visiting me with your children, with your husband. Uh, I will say, this, this, uh, These are my grandchildren, this is my son in law. So that is the only thing, you don't know, carry out, nothing else. Uh, ah. I would like you by that time, I will be answering Mama Professor because I know by that time you must have been a professor. You, you don't must mean have it. Backed, so may, you must have backed your professorship. So I will be answering Mama Professor mm, by that time. Mama Professor. Yes. Okay. It's, Mama a, professor. it's amazing. Mama Professor. <laughs> okay, guys. Yeah. I'm liking this. Like I'm enjoying this because I'm getting to even know more about her. It's not yeah. just you guys doing about me. Yeah. Okay, the next question is, when were you most proud of me? Hmm. I think I know, but I want to see if I'm if ah. I'm right. You know, it was the day I came for your graduation. I ceremony. just knew it. <laughs> the day I came for your graduation ceremony, that you came out with first class. I just knew it. And you had VC handshake. Oh, I was just moving proudly. That 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 girl is my daughter. That's my daughter. That is my daughter. And everybody, we are very happy to associate with me as the mother of the womb, the girl that came out with first class. Okay. Guys, I already knew this was going to be the answer. But I wanted to be sure that I was not overhyping it. That day, eh, if you see my mother's shoulder, if you see my mother's shoulder that day, you cannot pass her without knowing that her daughter came out with so 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 and so so. She collected plus the graduation manual, the big yes, one, sir. underlined my name, was showing mm. my father, came back mm. from UNN to where we base. I was showing people. That day, I was so happy. Trust me, guys. It's it's one of the most amazing things or beautiful things every child prays for. That point where you make your parents so proud. Like, you'll be very happy. Okay. The next question is, what is the worst thing I have ever done? <laughs> the worst thing you have ever done uh, will I say will I say the year you were to 
graduate that you refuse to come back you say you want to study so mm. yes now nah. is it the fire thing yes and not tell you you refuse to to come back home and the uh, all that happened i didn't know there was something like fire outbreak the sister now called me please give me chairman's best friend no phone number to call her so at that point i started crying i said something is wrong somewhere so there was fire outbreak in the school and god preserved their life and you did not care to call me so the way i received it i received it with great shock so i was not happy I, I that you didn't call guys, me to it's not, tell it's not me. the way she's making it sound mm. the truth is my mother panics a lot mm. if you know my mom you know that she panics a lot so when it happened i called my mentor he said the same thing he said have you told your mom you know she will, if she hears this thing outside mm. i said wait i was crying profusely that day because you know what it means to watch everything you have born in so I said, okay, the next day when I'm not crying, so that she will not feel like the way I'm crying, maybe they have hung my leg in orthopedic. <laughs> I said, the next day, I'll call her. But somehow, the thing reached her before the next day. And she must start crying. I remember when she called, she said, Choma, are you alive? Choma, are you? I said, but you're talking to me. <laughs> but you're talking to me. And she said, I want to kill her. I, want. I said, no, I would have told her. Trust me, I would have told her. But I was looking for the right timing the next day. She called me that morning. I was still, ah, mommy, that thing was not intentional. Lou. It was not intentional, but you, did, you didn't do it well. Because I was almost calling all your friends. Then I was having your friends' phone numbers. So I was calling all of them. So it was uh, one person that told me exactly what happened. Uh, so when something like that happened, the best thing to do is to call the person. Call your parents. I Tell called. Them. I called Aike. I called mm. my most senior brother, yes. guys. I you called call my sister, parents so that they will they will know that you are safe. They will not hear it from another port angle, so they will hear it directly from you. Like did I had an accident? The first person I called was your father. I called your father. I used my own phone, used my voice, called him so that he will hear my voice and know that I'm still alive. So he didn't panic, though he was worried, but he didn't panic like as if she, he heard it from another person. Okay. Mm. So you learn your lessons. Okay. Mm. Noted. Yes. I will not do it again. It will not even happen safe again. Amen. Amen. Mm. Amen. Okay. How was I in school? Mm. What kind of student was I? The uh, very serious student. The day, first day I took you to UNN, Soka. Hmm. Have you forgotten? From, even from, have from you forgotten? nursery primary, how was I when, when I was a child in okay. school? As a child, you were, you were a child that like reading. You study so much, you read so much. So, but the first day I carried you to soccer, the first thing that came out of your mouth is that I love this place. Mommy, have you seen how serious these ones are? Nobody is even carrying big phone. Nobody is even uh, dressing, that. nobody dressed so much. So that uh, explanation, that uh, mm -hmm. excitement gave me joy okay. that actually you are going there to read, not to just be away from parents. Okay. Mm. Okay. Mm. I was actually very, I am actually, I think I have slacked uh, during my master's, my mm. PhD. I was actually a very serious student, guys. Like, I mean, I mean, still now. <laughs> okay. So. Second to the last question, what will you change if you could raise me again? Hmm. What I will change is that I will, st I will start from the first day to give you all the food. <laughs> if you refuse to eat, I will force you to eat it. Was it, was it that bad? Ah. Ha. Do you know what it took me to, to, to even make you to even get to this level? But I like food now. That's the uh, irony. It was when we sat you down and talked sense into you that you started liking food okay mm. okay this one you use your hand accept it and uh, you started eating before when we bring food you just push it aside you just take one spoon take spoon, one and say i'm okay I yeah i used to, to be a very picky eater uh -huh. very very picky eater. You guys. other people will finish eating you will still be picking your own one 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 but it was the day we sat you down and explain the usefulness of food in a person's body. 
that was the day you started eating your food. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey. The last question. Hmm. This question, I don't even know how this question entered this right up. I saw it on the internet too. They say we should ask mother. Uh, yeah. Describe my perfect kind of guy. Yeah, perfect kind of guy. Mm -hmm. Man. <laughs> 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 well, I, my you, perfect kind of man. You always say that you 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 love a man that love God, a man that we equally know how to cook. That when one is sick, when one is heavy, the person can as well assist. And you, there's another point you always make. You say you want you like a man. That once in a while, the man with you people will eat out. You do sit out, not yeah, every no. time you eat in the house. Every it's not everyone now that is money for cement. Uh -huh, that yes, someone yeah. that just mm. pampers you now. <laughs> yes, that is it now. Uh, the man that will love you so much that you always say it. Uh. Uh, yes. You know, you are always my gossip partner. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, uh, let, me, let this camera go off. You will see the real my mother come hey, out. This woman. She's my gossip partner. Oh. Mm. She likes this. She's ah. I like this. She can gossip call you partner. for two hours. Mm. And then next she tell you, you did not even tell me anything where to. I'm like, what else you want me to uh, tell you now? Uh, go gossip now. That come up with gossip now. We I want just to, <laughs> I want to hear gossip. Uh, okay, uh, guys, this is all the questions I have. I, I couldn't even believe that we'll finish them without the time being too long. So, guys, these are the questions I have. Tell me in the comment section below which other questions you would love my mom to answer. I don't know when next she'll grace our channel which other questions you would you would have loved i asked her i want to read your comments in the comment section below would you have anything to say to my my youtube people well keep subscribing yes so yes so <laughs> <laughs> keep subscribe as you subscribe you will equally learn one or two things uh -huh. from chino talks abby yes <laughs> Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. This was fun to be with my mom. Yes, like, sir. guys, this was fun. Trust me. Like, all right, guys, thank you so much for watching. See you next time on Chilo Talks. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, drop a comment, turn on your notification bell. And as mommy said, as my mom said, please subscribe and keep on watching other videos. See you next time on Chilo Talks. Bye for now, guys. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye, bye. <laughs>